Hello everyone, this is Tech Buddies here and today we will show you how to install Sinogen Mod 14.1 official on your Moto X 2014. So head over to the Sinogen Mod link and uh, then download the first Sinogen Mod ROM, the nightly ROM which is available. I have installed it or downloaded it so I will not download it again. Then head over to another link that is the open gapps link and download the gapps of your choice. By default we select ARM because most phones support ARM. Then select Android 7.1 because this is a Sinogen mod 14.1 ROM. And then I will recommend you to go with a mini, micro, nano or pico G apps but I am preferring stock G apps here. So select everything and click that download button. I have downloaded it so I won't download it again. And now all you have to do is that you need to paste it inside a folder in your memory card. I have made a CM folder and inside that I have pasted the two files that is first one is the Sinogen mod 14.1 and another is the stock G apps. So just keep it in your memory card and the next thing that we have to do is that uh, we need to boot into the recovery. There are two methods to boot into recovery. The first method is what I am going to show you. So head over to your about phone and uh, then click the build number for seven times until you see that developer options is enabled. Then go to developer options and uh, tick the advanced restart tab. So what it does is that whenever you click the power button to power off your device or restart your device, uh, whenever you click restart, it will give you multiple options like this. You can select recovery, bootloaders, soft restart, anything. So this is quite handy and this is a way you can reboot into recovery. The next method is what I'm going to show you. So just hold your Moto X 2014, power off it. That is we are just switching off the device and I'm going to show you the button combination, how you can reach into recovery. So wait for it to power off. Then the next thing you need to do is that uh, hold the volume down button and the power button at the same time and keep them holding until you reach the fast boot. So press them and this is the fast boot as you can see. As soon as you are in fast boot then all you have to do is go down using the volume down button into recovery and select the up button to go into recovery. So this is TWRP recovery and uh, you need to have your phone rooted and install a custom recovery. So go into backup and first backup everything. This is very important in case you lo lose your files then you can restore back to your previous backup. So backup first. So yeah it is completed. I have just skipped the video. As you can see it is generating the MD5 and wait for it to complete. Yeah, so it is completed. Yeah, so now we will go back and now we need to clean install. So we will go to wipe and then swipe to factory reset. Wait for it. Then go back and we will go to advanced wipe and you have to select everything except internal storage and USB OTG or external storage. This is the Moto X 2014 so you don't have to select external SD because it doesn't support external SD. So select everything except the storages and wipe it. Go back, 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 go to install and then go to the CM folder where you have stored the ROM and the gapps file. So we will just head over to the ROM file and then swipe to confirm the flash. So we are installing the ROM now and after that we will install the G apps. Don't worry about the red log. Just uh, proceed. Wait for it. Yeah. So go back and then select the stock G apps or any G apps you have downloaded and swipe it. Now you can see that G apps is installing. I will skip the video. Yeah, so it has completed installing. Now reboot into the system. This is the last thing you have to do. Just reboot your phone to the system to see whether the ROM is installed properly or not. I will always recommend you to 
clean install that is format everything before you install any ROM yeah so we can see that Cyanogen mod logo be patient while the ROM boots up because it can take time so we will wait for it and I will just set it up and show it to you this is Android 7.1.1 so I will show you the version for the confirmation settings then head over to about phone yeah you can see that it is 7.1.1 it is the stock G apps we have flashed so this is Nexus like so enjoy and uh, share this video to your friends and uh, please note that this is for the Moto X 2014 only I will see you in the next video bye bye take care and thank you